And Tyner swings it out to the running back. That's Ellerby who escapes the tackle and gets the first down. Able to shed a man and pick up 10 yards. Tyner to throw it over the middle. Wide open man. That's Tyner's Aaron Cephas. And it's another first down for the Rice Owls, Aaron who are Cephas. slight favorites in this game. We do expect a good one, though, from here in Houston. Well, hear the wind whipping through a little bit. It is a bit of a breezy night. And the handoff is to Austin Walter, and he is thrown out right at the line of scrimmage. Anthony Wint is the big man. First team All-Conference USA to begin the season. We see why right there. Wint is the, is the heart and soul of this defense. He, he's a, a linebacker that can run sideline to sideline, as I mentioned earlier. And he's not fooled. He has great eye discipline. And as you can see, he can lower the boom. As Alex Magoo gets the Gents set on second and two. And he'll step up into the pocket. He'll tuck and run, diving across the 35-yard line. Had a good block out there from Julian Williams, the wide receiver. Just not playing on this opening possession. Third down and eight. Magoo has a man, has the first down at the 48-yard line. That's Tony Gator, the fourth. Tony Gator, the fourth. The great route by Tony Gator. He was lined up 14, against a linebacker Bertha, in the slot, ran a 10-yard out, and was able to create the separation for the first down. First-year defensive coordinator. Magoo to throw under pressure and escapes the first, but not the second nor the third. Brian Womack and finally ripped him down in the backfield, Brian and they'll Womack. have to punt. Sean Ellerby again getting the start because Sam Stewart is out. We were told he has broken ribs, and there's a chance in an emergency that he could play. That's a pass complete for a first down. It's Aaron Cephas once again, the freshman, who had a couple receptions earlier on this season, one for 52 yards, but a couple first downs in the first quarter. Well, Tyner and Cephas have something going early as he, as he catches them on a quick slant across the middle. We'll hit more on that throughout the broadcast here. Cameron has several details. Talk more about it at halftime as well. Tyner, pump fake, and hit. Down he goes. And that's James Sheriff, the 6'2 junior. Burden 23. I don't know too many teams that have a play for this one. And Rice definitely is not a quick strike offense, so they go with an option play, get a chunk of it back, and still on his feet is Emmanuel Osupa, close to a first down, didn't quite get there, but picked up about 21 on third and 23. He'll keep it. Magoo fooled everybody, and Magoo is down the seam inside the 45-yard line. For the first responders here and down near FIU. Magoo on the first play of the second quarter has his man. That's a touchdown. It's his tight end, Farrell McKeever, the graduate transfer from NC State. <laughs> Great job by McKeever. They ran the play action, misdirection. He started with the block, came underneath the offense. Great job catching the ball. McKeever has a bright future. He's going to have an excellent season, 6'6", 250 plus pounds. This is the big man who can move. Excellent tight end. Her left to right. Tyner stepping up, and he'll have the first down and more. The umpire got in the way. Umpire throws a block with his backside on Anthony Wint. Formation. The only success they've had is through the air. They go with the double reverse. Parker Smith gonna throw it, and he's got the quarterback, Tyner, inside the five. complete, 14. Jackson Tyner with the catch. He's out of bounds. And they're hurrying up on a gain of 17. It's first and goal. I don't know if Tyner got his feet in on the catch, but great play call by Billy Lynch. A little misdirection with the pass. Tyner keeps it himself and dives in for a touchdown. 14, Jackson, Tyner. How about that? Third down and long. And if they get it off with one second to spare. Magoo chased by Womack, gets rid of it, and has his man for a first down. Great Ooh. catch on the sideline by Austin Maloney. Under center. With Gardner in the backfield. They fake the handoff to him. He's looking uh -oh. long. He's got a man behind the defense, but it's underthrown and intercepted. What a play by Justin Pickham. 
Great play by Justin Bickle. After the interception, first and 10 at the five yard line. And again, that FIU defense behind the line. Trayvon Williams. Long plays. And again, a quick snap. Not much doing though. In fact, he doesn't get back to the line of scrimmage. Parker Hanusa, fourth down and six. Magoo. Buying time, directing traffic, rolling up, cutting inside and upended. Christian Bertrand made the tackle that saved the first down. And it's over the middle, complete. Midfield into FIU territory. Aaron Cephas has been a busy man tonight. For Houston, they are gonna throw it. It's a screen pass. And it will be a first down and more. And that's what you want to do as an offense. At the beginning of a two-minute drill, you want to get a positive play. You want to try a draw or a screen. It's simple, but it's profound. Be where your feet are. Be right here, right now. And right now, we've got a first down and more, and maybe a busted coverage. Darius Scott was left uncovered, and there's two kick coming from 44 yards. It would be a season-long and a career-long for the redshirt freshman, Jose Borregales. Has the leg, and he got it. The kick is good, his time expires. Great kick from Borregales. Got the protection right, and that's a pass complete to Gator, who sneaks free down the sideline. 40-35, and brought down that's from behind. At the end of the first half. Snap is good. And the kick is good. It's first and 10 for the Panthers. Play action, Magoo, and he's going to be sacked by Womack. Oh, 44 has been all over that backfield tonight. Well, how to do the Macarena. This must be an alum from the 90s. Oh, big in the backfield, and the ball is out. Gardner on top of it. Play action pass. He'll check it down, and he has Granson at the sticks. Pass. Emergency by this Rice offense. Let's go for it on fourth, and a fumbled snap, but picked up. Tyner still on his feet. Not now. Brought down from behind by Tyner Newton Salisbury. They run the option with Walter. The pitch is to Walter. Walter reverses field. Now tries to cut it back the other way, and he's spun down. Anthony Johnson. A big stop or maybe a big play to take a lead in this game. And it's another sack. And it's a sack. Roe Wilkins game as FIU begins Butch Davis's first season with a conference opening victory on the road at Rice. The Owls drop to one and one in conference play, while the Panthers get to one and oh, and two and one